I was talking to the Lord and I was talking um, to him about prayer and what the Lord showed me kind of blew me away in a sense. I kind of talked about a little bit in my book, but today he kind of like just revealed a little more to me. Um, he wanted to speak with me and automatically um, I went right into put on to put on my worship music, you know, go through the whole thing that I normally go through when I when I go to pray because in my mind I'm blocking out distractions and what the Lord said to me is that no the music that you're about to put on is going to be a distraction I want to take you one way in prayer but this music is going to take you another way and it kind of like made me think oh my gosh how many times do we go to God in prayer and we go through the the routine the motions of the routine where we feel like this is me setting my atmosphere or this is me blocking out distractions what happens when your routine becomes a distraction? You got to learn to pray without the music, without the worship instrumental. You got to learn how to pray without being in uh, the place that you designed for your prayer closet to be. And not that there's anything wrong with these things. They all have their appointed times um, that we use them, but we got to be sensitive in the moment. That, is this routine actually bringing me closer or is it pulling me away because what God wants to do in this moment has nothing to do with my instrumental it has nothing to do with the music that I like to play when I go to worship so I say to you beloved people be open because our routine can distract what God wants to do in the moment <laughs>